Am I the only one that remembers how Ryan Jones was accused of being Pride Hunter in the very beginning? Watch this video, and I'm going to be right back. Let's talk about Pride Hunter, shall we? We're going to talk about the original one, Ryan Jones, and then the copycat account. Because there's somebody out here trying to push a narrative that Mia was the Pride Hunter all, all along. But here's the thing. That Facebook text message was actually sent to Mikey. Notice the date, December 30th, 2020. That's your name, Mikey. That's the same message that Mia was holding up in the video. And here's the rest of it. See, you passed this message along to Mia. So if you're saying it's fake, did you make the messages up? Because they came from you. You seem to have forgotten, Mikey, that you were the one that gave me that message and told me that this Ryan Jones was coming after me, talking about hanging me from a tree. By the way, the Pride Hunter, the original, his name was not Ryan Jones. But you should know that, right? Like that. Also, anybody else remember how Ryan Jones all of a sudden became a 15-year-old boy called Timmy? Who was That's really weird because Timmy was never a child. So why did you bring him up as a 15-year-old kid? But since we're talking about children, let's do a story time, Michael. You created a business page for me called God is Me a Pride. And you called me and told me that you and Chucky were going to work that page for me because you knew I was so busy. Well, during the time all that beef was happening in February, I told you that I wanted Chucky off of that page. Now, I went to that page to go check it out, and I happened to notice something really crazy with the like videos. I called you, and I told you, why are there videos of young children on the like videos of the Goddess Me a Pride business page? You told me it was Chucky. So I reiterated that I wanted the passwords changed because that was gross. And then you did a video right after that going after Scott McFly. You basically called him a pedo, and I told you to take that video down because you had no proof that he was. But you claimed that because your For You page had a bunch of young kids on it, that he had to be it because he blocked you. I just assumed that you was confused, but you took the video down. Because again, like I told you, you cannot call somebody that without no fucking proof. It was very confusing to me, but I got a video sent to me today. Watch this video and I'll be right back. Your fault. Don't even let it bother you. If they don't come back, they're lost. Besides, you are a pedophile's dream. Ugh. What the entire fuck, Mikey? Explain yourself!